Hello everyone. Today I'm gonna show you how to use how to analyze a complete randomized design or CRD using Garo Studio. And as all of you know, that CRD design is suitable for homogeneous environment and it's very easy for layout analysis and interpret, as well as it gives an opportunity for unequal number of replication. At the same time, also it gives a maximum degree of error uh degree of freedom for error term so let's import our data set and uh, my data format is excel so i'll locate uh, the directory so here is uh, the data name is challenge then i import so please click this import button so the first step is uh, uh, to check you have to check the structure uh, because maybe the dependent or independent variable uh, as maybe as a factor maybe as a, a numeric maybe also as integer so especially your uh, independent variable should be uh, labeled as uh, a factor so if it's not that you have to change into the factor so first to in order to check our structure or you have to write str then your data so let's check it so as you see here here is the block here is the treatment here is the dependent variable that means a set so treatment here is what it is a character it must be a factor so you have to change from character to factor by writing this syntax so first you have to locate your data name then using dollar sign attach treatment then open function and use this as dot factor that means as dot factor means changing a character into a factor so uh, by doing again this name or locate your data then use dollar sign to attach it to treatment then let's run then let's check let's check, let's check back so here you have the structure and challenge is your data name so let's run and as you see here is a factor before uh, changing the factor the treatment is labeled as what as character so now it's okay then you have you have to analyze very easily and you have to use linear model uh, for CRG design latin square design and also random complete block design so you can give any name that you want then open the function then write lm lm stands for linear model and here you will have a dependent variable and as explained by this simple indicate as explained by uh, treatment treatment is independent variable then you have to locate your data so you have to run immediately then ANOVA the name that you given is what work so ANOVA work and then run so uh, the result of analysis table analysis of variance shows that the treatment uh, between the treatment there is what significant difference so we need uh, uh, we need to separate which treatment is significant which treatment is gives the highest uh, seed germination so in order to answer that question we have to use mean separation technique before proceeding mean to mean separation technique you have to call uh, agricole agricole is a package that uses to analyze and interpret agricultural related data data so here library then you call uh, open uh, bracket then write agricole then immediately run it's already uh, already established so write this statement uh, analysis of variance dot out open function then user model then you have dependent variable as explained by independent variable data is equal to challenge challenges of data name so let's write then uh, the missing operation technique for this video tutorial uh, use this what less significant difference so lsd dot test and aov out means that we described here before so aov dot uh, out then a comma then under quotation uh, we have to enter the treatment because the mean separation technique to identify the difference between the treatments then console is equal to true yes so 
the Tesman, the Arasan, the Fermat, Spurgeon, they are similarly, uh, they are similar but uh, different component control. So by this way you can separate uh, the difference between the treatments. So if you have any question regarding to my tutorial, you are to provide comments and question in the YouTube uh, comment box. And also please subscribe my channel for upcoming videos. Thank you. Thank you.